Once I was a little girl, my mom used to be telling me, my daughter, when you grow up, never forget these three important words in your life. In Swahili, we say them. Asante. Once a person gives you something, even if it is yours, always say that. Naomba. Whatever you want to take something from someone, every day, anytime, just say Naomba. And that person will give you deeply from the heart. Samahani, once you do something wrong, always go down your knees and say sorry. Hivyo basi, manino haa matatu ni muhimu sana. Asante, naomba, na samahani. Thanks to my mama. Lekina the same time, happy birthday to CCM, chama, chama pinduzi. Mbapo hii, mbapo hiki ni chama mbacho kinaungoza nchi yetu. Toka ni mezaliwa, since I was a kid, I've always been knowing kwa mba. CCM ni moja kati ya vama mbavyo vinaungoza Tanzania. Na leo imetimiza umro miaka arubaini na tatu. And so saying, present magufuli. Cheers to you. Ni siku ngine tena kwenye news feed and I go by the name Juju Duffer. I have four stories. One, two are from Tanzania. One is from Nigeria and the other is from there, there. Nchini Marikani. Okay, the first story is from Tanzania. I'm going to speak about Nini, a Tanzanian artist here. And also, John McKinney is also a Tanzanian artist. And thirdly, is from Nigeria plus two, three, four. I'm going to speak about Davido and his fiancée, Chioma. Last week, I'm going to speak about the relationship between Travis Scott and Kylie Jaina. Nini has been on rumors that she is going out dating Newa Mitego, who is also a Tanzanian artist. Uh, through the interview that she did with us, Global Radio and Global TV, she clarified that these two are not dating and they're just friends. But through her Instagram post, it is something so weird uh, because, as we all know, 14th of February, Nisiko Yawapenda now, and it is called uh, Valentine's Day. And she posted a picture with a caption that simply shows that these two are together and they are still dating. And she has been having that audacity of the guy and calling uh, calling calling him a friend a brother um shikaji wangu and sort of things like that lakini watalio ya nakwambia huyu kusoma hata picha uoni nini could you please clarify this wambea tunapata shida are you going out with neo mitego ama kuna kitu ambacho kiko under the carpet sisi hatu kifahamu it is something so big lakini simba nini kutoka lakini kinacho umiza miyo ya watu wengi na akiliza tu kutukereketa when you deny that the fact that you're dating the guy wakati turning the corner on the other side you two are all going out my friend it is better to keep your relationship strong and stop posting on social medias because nobody likes a person to be happy trust me okay there might be a person who loves you to be happy but not all of us it might be only 20 percent in 100 percent but the 80 percent wants you and the guy breaking up and so saying sometimes it is good to keep your relationship private because what the enemy doesn't know he or she cannot attack secondly as i as i said i'm gonna speak about uh joe mckinney joe, Mc, joe mckinney is one among uh the guys uh, from tanzania yeah, he has this kind of a good voice the way he dresses he has this kind of rage you know he's kind of handsome i can say and he's one among those guys that really had they are really working hard to make sure uh, the music of tanzania goes there up Okay, what has Joe McKinney done this time? It is really a pleasure seeing uh, East African countries uh, communicating and doing things that are one. Because he is a Tanzanian, but uh, on 28th of February, he will go to perform in Uganda uh, on Uganda Hip Hop Awards, uh, whereby he is a hip hop artist from Tanzania. But going to perform in Uganda it is something that is so big. And through his Instagram page, he, oh, he posted a picture confirming to us that he, he will be there. Let me just read as it is. This for my Uganda and people the king will be there this february on 28th performing live at mtn warehouse uganda hip-hop awards get ready mtn ug hip-hop awards 2020 let me tell you that on this awards there will be a lot of nominations and nom uh, nominations and nominees from uganda well we have the best rapper of the year uh best female rapper best male rapper uh best collaboration of the year uh we also have uh, diaspora diaspora awards and many other and so saint jama will be there to uh, to, I can say to Akilisha is something that is so big and I'm so proud of being a Tanzanian because as I can see it is not only one person that takes the flag to the other country or to the other nation majority of us try our level best to take Tanzania to the world as we all see Diamond Bottoms taking Tanzania to the world and Mbwana Ali Samata doing the same thing Nandi, uh, Vanessa Mde and many others and so saying uh, not only international whites uh, actually it's all globally uh, people know Tanzania from, from the artists that we have 
from the government that we have, from the people that we have. I, I, I once had a, a story that a majority of people are asking, who is John Pombe Magufuli? Like they've been, they've been, hearing, uh, they've been hearing who rumors about Tanzania, but they really don't know who is President John Magufuli. And they've been saying that this is one among the best presidents the world could ever, never have. Because he's so hardworking, very patient, but has always been doing things to not only please the ones who are above, but also the ones who are under. And so saying I'm proud of being a young Tanzanian princess. Okay, my third story in Kutokea Nchini, Nigeria, plus two, three, four. Here I'm going to speak about the uh, uh, Nigerian artist, yani leo kama na ungzungumze sana watani, utani samehe, bakini uh, katika engu ya kimataifa hao ndo ambao kwa sasa wako kwenye chat na ndo ambao wanatikisa dunia. Davido, da, uh, okay, Davido ni moja kati ya usani wakubwa sana nchini Nigeria, na ni moja kati ya watu ambao wamepewa sifa kubwa kutokana na kili ambacho wamepewa kikifanya. Davido uh, has, uh, has kids from different mothers, like different fiancés, uh, actually I can say ex, uh, but he's one among those who take a very good care of his kids. No matter you break up with the video, but as long as he knows you have a kid with him, he'll always be a responsible father for his kids. We have seen this and we have all the evidence proving that. But uh, currently there is a situation that has been roam, roam, roaming around and roaming around the world that uh, Chioma and Davido are breaking up like they've split and it is something that has been aching him. And through his Instagram page, he once proved to others these two are, to, are still together. Uh, they were in Dubai on his brother's wedding and we saw Davido dancing and very happy. He was also with Chioma right beside him. And apart from that, uh, yesterday day when they went on a club they were dancing proving that to the world that i am still with this one and you are still banging huh what are you saying guys that we broke up no we are still together Lakini ni kitu ambacho kimekuwa kikiumiza mioyo ya watu wengi ni pale ambapo the video has been offering a lot of gifts to Chioma. You know, sometimes it's really good to get a gift from a person you love, either it's your woman or your wife. We have seen Cardi B uh, with his uh, you know with his husband, I can say a man, offset on his birthday. Cardi B offered offset dollars, millions, and everyone was so shocked. Like, I wish I had a girlfriend like Cardi B, my friend. You should first build her for her to build you. Take it from me. Lakini, uh, the video ameza kuprovia wengi kwamba anampenda sana manamke huyo. Kwani ameza kumzawadia saa yenye sa, samani ya milioni sita. 6 million naira pesos like in Nigeria. He's all, ambapo sani nzuri sana. Oh my God, it's not wealthy like mine. No. Even mine is wealthy. I don't know. I don't I have to say it. But it's something so big and Chioma looks very happy. I wish them nothing but a happy relationship. But one thing I should also say this again. Trust me. It is really not good putting a relationship on social media. Uh, because once you expose your relationship on social media, the day that you break up, everybody will know. The day that you guys have a quarrel, everybody will know. A misunderstanding, everybody will know. When you guys are happy, everybody will know. And trust me, not everybody is happy be uh, for you to be in a relationship, for you to be happy. A lot of people wish you nothing but for you guys to break up and go in separate ways. Now, when you go to you come back to the channel too. Once you post that you guys are so happy, the day that you guys split, ha, my friend, you have nowhere to put your face, so take it from me. Lastly, Kabisa, kama ambavyo nimeza kukujuta, nitezungumzia mausiano kati ya Travis Scott na Kylie Jaina. These two, uh, wamefaniko kupata mtuto wa moja na kwenda kwenye last Tommy, ambapo last Thursday, Saturday, ametimiza miaka miwili. And it is all over the world that they spent 1.1 billion dollars on this killer. Take it from me, 1.1 billion. Uh huh. And it's something that is so big and so aching. And I'm like, oh my god, I wish I had money. I wish I was. Uh, I, I wish I was Kylie. Kylie is very young, only 22, 23 years old. Like, and she has been doing things that are so, so big to prove to the world that age doesn't matter. What matters is how you work hard and how much you want to establish your goals and ambitions to reach there. Okay, Kylie Jenner and uh, Travis Scott. Uh, Previously, uh, these two separated according to people and according to what others were saying. And it was seen that uh, she's kinda, kinda close to Drake. So the extent of people saying, okay, now Travis, uh, Amir Chana, uh, Nakali, and she is now with Drake. And pointing to the right, right direction when uh, Travis was once asked about this, he claimed that 
yeye pamoja na Trap, yeye pamoja na Kyle they are still together raising their kid. Na katika mahojiano yake ameweza kusema pia kwamba wawili hawa hawaja separate. Lakini vile vile Kyle aliweza kuchupuvia na kusema kwamba on on her life a person who matters ni Stormy pamoja na kipenzi chake huyo Travis Scott. And as I once said on Saturday it was the, the kids birthday we saw them very happy uh, enjoying taking pictures you know like these two are together. And apart from that there is a video uh, all over the world uh, showing these two um uh, like having a tattoo of their kid uh, called Stormy and it's something so big and something so wonderful to see your parents having the tattoo of your name. Trust me it really it is really such a big thing. The kid is really small, two years old. I really don't think she understands. Lakini kadri anavyozidi kukua anaendelea kujifunza mapenzi kati ya baba na mama yake. I would love to say something about this. Once you two separate, doesn't mean kwamba watoto wenu basi waandago mateso ambayo nyie wawili mnapitia. No. If you are dating a person and you have a kid with that person, make sure you are a responsible father or a responsible mother. Like at the same time once you two are together and your kid is also there, try to show some love. Even when you're faking, like you let the kid know kwamba baba na mama wanapendana. Baba na mama wanaheshimiana. It doesn't mean kwamba you guys splitting basi ndio mwa affect maisha ya mtoto either academically or emotionally. As a kid I I speak it and I'm, I'm, I'm saying this from the heart because parents wao ndo ambao wanatumizaga sana mioyo pale ambapo unaona baba na mama yako wanagombana halafu kwamba like hakuna tena njia wao kuweza kupatana ukiwa kama mtoto unatamani uwapatanishe lakini how could you do this if the two doesn't want to get along it is something so big and it is something that a lot of parents should learn watoto tunaumizwa jamani pale ambapo wazazi hampatani basi tukiwa around jitahidini hata kutuonyesha upendo na kuheshimiana kati yenu ili na sisi mwisho wa siku tujifunze kutoka kwenu kwamba hata kama they are not in good terms lakini tukiwa nao ama kwa ajili yetu sisi wameamua kupatana na kuwa wamoja tena I really have nothing to add kwenye news feed leo nimefikia mwisho na tamati if you have not subscribed our channel please do so for you to be able to be the first person to get all the updates on our global tv channel facebook and instagram is global publishers twitter is global habari our website is www.goalpublishers.co.tz i love you all and thank you for watching global tv